the independence of the sea. You gotta look. So today is the last day of our cruise. We are at sea. And here's a shot of the promenade. I'll get more footage so you guys can get a sense of... They have a lot of variety of candy in here. out of the promenade. I'll get more footage so you guys can get a sense of what it has. This is a shot of their, where is it, a gift store? Yeah. And it's pretty big, the size of this ship. See right here, just panning around. Look how big and spacious it is. It's weird because when we were in the ovation of the seas, um, the ship was like much larger, but the gift store was like maybe a quarter this size. Clothes on our last Here's uh, more footage of the promenade. Uh, I have the camera zoomed out. So it might look a little distorted, a bit larger than it really looks, but it's still a pretty decent sized promenade. Here's the store for perfumes and makeup. Here is a bar. There's a car. And then right there. Little area to for discounted clothing. Watches in the back. Micro Ford course store. And over here we have a cafe. Yeah, Starbucks, they have sandwiches, cookies, uh, well desserts. And over here is a Ben and Jerry's ice cream shop. Here's the candy store. And another first store over there. Here's the candy store. I don't know if I can get it. What is that? Sour and bubble nut. That's the thing, they have such a unique variety of candy here. And it's a lot. Look at this. For a ship. They have a lot of variety of candy in here. It's a unique flavor. So I'm over here. Even more options. All kinds of sweets. All kinds of toy based candy. All kinds of plush dolls. 
It's like a big giant sandwich ice cream plush. That's cool. And then even more plushy stuff. Back. It's a pretty huge shop. Yeah. Red Hot Candy. Sugar Pops. Laser Pops. Jumbo. Jumbo size. Polygons. Have a lot. This is like one of the largest candy stores I've seen. Rivals out of the mall, right? Pac-Man. Oh yeah. Pac-Man flavored candy. Here's another shot of the plush toys. Oh, not so much. Oh yeah, it's lightsaber candy. Uh -oh, I can't hear it at all. How's that candy? <laughs> I guess it's just a toy. Ah, uh, dispenser candy. Uh, Troll. That's the dispensers. Candy pops. This is a lot. A lot here. Here's the other smaller end of the promenade. And see here, gorgeous area. The lantern floating on top. Over here is guest services on the left, and on the right, it's just another bar, hang out and chill. And if, uh, further forward is the main dining room area. One of them. I think there's three of them on this ship. Three yeah. or four main dining rooms. All in all, very beautiful. We are on deck four of the ship. Here's another bar. that painfully the hard one. <laughs> I will say this, the casino here is pretty big. That's big. It's a very big area uh, compared to some of the other ships that are larger but have a smaller casino. A few moments later. How much you win? How much is that? Wow. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, oh, you got something out of it. Oh, is that 11 bucks? Uh oh. Oh, boy, folks. I think she's going to find herself here for a while. Can you imagine if I would have got the $1,000? Yeah, she ended up getting the miner. Oh, oh boy. Uh oh. Do the scratch. Gotta pick three. Match three. Got a trident. I don't know what that means. Oh, a mini. A mini is 11 bucks. At least it's something. Oh, you still keep going? Uh oh. One more, uh, minor. Oh, 
Folks, this was supposed to be a quick five minute game. <laughs> yeah, I think she's not moving from here. We've been here for a few hours. No, we are not here. Yeah. Uh oh. Touch this spin. Yeah, now you gotta go all the way up. Oh man. I have to go further back. Hello. Uh oh. Oh. Here we go, here we go. Right here. Come on, come on, come on. Big money, big money, big money. Oh, oh. 900. 9,000. You're close to that, though. I know. It was a teaser. Yeah. It actually keeps uh, bouncing back and forth between the $90 and the $70 range. Not bad, though. I mean, at least it's entertaining. One eternity later. Oh, there you go. All right, so I was up to what, 85 and back down to 65. But I only started with $10, so that's good. Not bad. And here is the other side of the, of the casino. On deck four, you have another bar. It's a piano bar. It's very beautiful, right? Usually late at night, this place gets packed with people. And is the theater over here? No, it's not. It's uh, one deck down, I think. And this is deck 11, uh, the adult solarium area. And you can see here, it's similar to um, Mariner of the Seas, where it's just a smaller, area to lounge around with its own pool but the main difference here is you notice if you look at this uh, ceiling or the roof there's, there isn't one it's open when it rains you get it down here too it has some partial covering for some of the lounge chairs but each side has an infinity pool uh, hot tub. it's very nice and then you know solarian bar right there in the middle Here's an exterior shot of the adult solarium. Now the sun's come out. Pretty nice. Pretty chill. The next day. Here we are on our last day, last morning, last moments on our stateroom, last cruise ship of the year. Yeah, of the year. Catch that. Said, of the year. Doesn't mean next year. And we are December 2nd. So. Hmm. Gotta go home and plan our next trip. Mm. Right yeah. now, we're just gonna be sad. Exactly. Great trip, and I would suggest this cruise ship again. All in all, it was pretty good? Yeah. Great. Alright. Well, until next time. Oh. Our video. Oh. <laughs> Hit that like button. Thumbs up icon. 
and hit subscribe. All right, see you.